This video game isn't just an after-school pastime. Its developers say it could help keep kids safe. Car crashes are the leading cause of death in teens. This game teaches defensive driving. It's meant to be a supplement to existing driver's education. The purpose is to change the way we teach teenagers how to drive because what we call driver ed in America today is not. It's sign education to pass a written test. The game system is based on a frame used for flight simulation made by Hot Seat Sim. The developers are engineering students at Cooper Union in New York City. They hope to teach kids in a more practical way than driver's ed currently does by itself. We're doing it virtually so that that way they can go through the experience, realize that their intuition is wrong, and train themselves for these scenarios so that they're better prepared when they actually happen. The game reinforces muscle memory or repeating specific motions in response to several scenarios, like panic lane changes and abrupt braking. Crashes may happen, but only in the virtual world. Kids play games, and the games have gotten so sophisticated, so realistic, they don't want to stop playing. We give them the right tools to make them think they're playing a game, but they're really learning something more serious, which is driving a vehicle. The game setup consists of a seat, screen, and steering wheel. Plus, there's surround sound. Uh, we've got a six-speaker Dolby Digital 5.1 surround sound system. And graphic elements programmed by students. They're even planning to record voiceovers, like you find in video games made purely for entertainment. The game's developers hope to partner with insurance companies to promote the game across the country. In New York, I'm Althea Chang.